Okay, it's that time again to see some more open homes with Elaine Burkett from Mike Perro Real Estate. Morning, Elaine. Good morning. So what have you got for us today? What's the theme? We've got rural and lifestyle property today. Oh, I love a good lifestyle property. This will be property. some good ones. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's start with Horanui. Yeah, so this is a fabulous mix of um, lifestyle and luxury down in Canterbury. Um, it'll be a great find for the family. Um, big and lovable kitchen. You've got your terrific island bench there. Double ovens, so cater to a big family. Nice country style family living and beautiful polished wooden floors through there. Um, you'll see that there's uh, three living rooms in total. There's also two offices, so it's a substantial property. It's got a total floor area of 334 square metres. Oh, that's huge. Look at that beautiful view. Yeah, it's lovely. It's got good quality throughout. Um, four, four bedrooms, um, two of them have got en suites, and the remaining two bedrooms share um, an interconnecting bathroom. So it's oh. on a total of 4.4 hectares, oh. so big bit of land. You've got a nice fenced pool as well, so good for summer fun and entertaining. Um, and it's an awesome area to live in down there. There's lots of vineyards, cellar doors, wineries, you name it. And did I see a little river sort of, you know, in the distance yeah, in one of those shots? Yep. You can go down there and do some fishing as you well. Can. Come back, soak oh, in your pool. It looks awesome. Oh. So what are we talking um, money-wise? That one's inquiries over 845000 <sighs> Bargain. Okay, great. Let's head now to Selwyn. What have you got there for us? Yeah, so I've got another four um, hectare block, so 10 acres in total, and it's a beautiful lifestyle here on offer. It's a bit of a farmlet, um, ideal lifestyle block, and it's been tastefully redecorated um, with keeping some of that original charm, as you can see. Um, Daylight-filled living areas. You've got your little snuggle-up fireplace there. Um, and it's just a gorgeous, traditional, easygoing elegance throughout the interior. Yeah, I love the character of that house, eh? mm. especially that wraparound oh, nice porch. Bar. Yeah, beautiful. Look at that. Yeah. And so it looks like some some vineyard, some vines there. Yeah. yeah, and you've got you know your nice wide verandas there. So um, just a gorgeous property. You've got open bays for horses if you've got them. There's also some lockable work sheds and you know a bit of if you're a bit of a hobby grower. Although Jeez. that looks yeah. a bit bigger than that. <laughs> that's on your own nursery. <laughs> that's yeah. a right on mower lawn. That oh, one there right is. That. Definitely, yeah. it's a just a beautiful, beautiful. property. Yeah. Love it. Okay, what are we talking about? Seven hundred and sixty-five thousand. No. Wow, okay, that'll be snapped up fast. That's beautiful. <laughs> okay, be. let's head to Carterton now. The way that yeah, so this is going to suit someone who's looking for a weekend escape from Wellington or if you want to change to the good life in a bit of a nature playground, this is the one. Got a nice country-style kitchen uh, where wood is the feature. And we've got spacious living rooms, huge bifold doors, ideal for the family to get together. And there's also a second living room. Wow. There's million dollar views from this property as well. So. Yeah, and a lot of people are making Carterton a holiday home place, aren't they? Yeah. yeah. This yeah. is a spectacular property. You know, if you're a family that's into camping um, and that sort of thing, it's close to um, the river, so you get down there and, and have a play in the Waiahine River. Just such a special little spot. It's again on um, four hectares, so really big <gasps> property. Was well, that an yep. outdoor bath? It's an outdoor soaking Oh, tub. that's some Instagrammable moments in that bath, isn't it? <laughs> Could be. <laughs> yeah, lovely. Look, offers over 585,000 for 585, that. 585,000? That's ridiculous. That's wow. great. I'm loving this. Wow. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's head now to Franklin. So mm -hmm. we're heading further north. Yeah, so this is situated on the Sunset Coast in Auckland. It's really horse and hound country out there. Everyone seems to have horses and dogs. And it's been beautifully um, renovated. Most likely this was one of the original farmhouses in the district, so a lot of special history behind it as well. It's a beautiful double bay villa and it, look, the renovation's just gorgeous. Um, total of four bedrooms um, and there's the prospect of completing an ensuite into one of those bedrooms as well. Yeah, and they've retained all the character on this too, haven't yeah, they? Yeah, lovely elegant bathroom. And it's a rare find. It's on 8,008 square metres with resource consent to divide into four sites. So we're talking a lot of potential. You know, you've got the potential to retire out there on a smaller site. OK, so I'm picking a bit more expensive than yeah. the others we've seen. What yep. are you talking? We're talking a million plus. OK, okay. good. Okay. Nice. Good price. And finally, let's head to Rodney. Mm -hmm. And this is a nice property up in Puhoi. Um, it's unique and it's located on the Puhoi River. So just outside the historic village up there. Um, fabulous kitchen that's been designed for cooking and gathering around. 
there it Ooh, is nice nice yeah. outlook too lovely rural outlooks um, from this property as well it's character filled oh. and it's a bit of a free thinking home the design behind it and the, you know you can see the the lovely decor it's being really looked after mm. um, there's great north facing decks of this property as well so you can look out over your paddocks and there's um, good spot for entertaining out under the stars just a nice for you know that change of pace if you're looking for it. it's only two minutes from the motorway so that's on 2.24 hectares so good good amount of space there for your ride on Mike Oh yes, there you go. And again, another little sort of river creek type yeah. thing. You can go and do some stand-up paddle boarding. It's very Auckland, isn't it? In, in, in your creek? You can yeah. do mine. Um, so what are we talking cost-wise? What are we talking price-wise? 1.195. <laughs> nice. Excellent. Hey, thank you so much, Elaine. And if you see more on these properties and others, you can go to mikeperro.com.